In this video, I'll demonstrate scanning basics on the Ricoh machine. From the home page, click on Scanner Classic. On the left are your settings. The window shows the current settings as Auto Color Select, 200 DPI, and Auto Detect. To change any of those, click on Scan Settings. Here, I could change it to black and white, grayscale, etc. Resolution from 100 dpi up to 600, the default being 200 currently. Scan size is on auto detect. You can choose a specific size, especially if you're scanning something small in the glass. You can choose 8.5 by 11. Reset clears your settings back to the default. Moving down, original feed type. The default is one-sided scan. If you have a two-sided original, click there and turn on two-sided. In addition, in that same button, original feed type, you can batch scan. If your originals exceed the capacity of the feeder, you can build that job and make it one PDF. Another nice feature is divide. By turning on divide per one sheet, it says divide. Now, if I put five sheets in the feeder and send it to an email address, it would have one email, five PDFs. So it splits up each page into its own PDF. Moving down, send file type name. Here you can click on file name and change that file name. You can also put a text in the body of the email, a subject as well. As you can see, this tab is on email. If you're scanning to folder, click on scan to folder and your current destinations to folders will show up. Toggle between the two. To create a new destination, click on PRGDEST, which is Program Destination, and it's a shortcut to the address book, and it will walk you through setting up a new email. Cancel. Recall Program Change Program. This is a nice feature that has up to 25 presets where you can create a preset for easy retrieval in the future. For example, if I had two-sided scan, I could program that in as a quick key. Reset, start to begin scanning. Stop to stop your scan. And home, the house, to return to the home page.